I'm back out here at COSI. I have my daughter Presley with me because we're going to do some at home experiments. Joe Wood is with me. So COSI is closed for a month of kind yes. of just cleaning and resetting yep. an annual event, but there's still plenty of things that you can do yes. while the doors are closed. That's right. So we got an example of uh, one of our activities that is on our Connects website that you can do at home. Okay. Um, so what we've got here first is we've got some real science of how paleontologists, which is a uh, type of scientist that studies fossils, how they extract fossils. I've got a piece of, this is a rock called shale, and there's a real fossil inside. Wanna scrape it, baby? So this is like a real legit. Yes. Wow. So this, uh, this shale and the fossil inside is about 387 million years old. No way. Um, and you can see how long this process takes. You know, yeah. Paleontologists are gonna use everything from like big jackhammers or even like construction equipment uh -huh. all the way down to toothbrushes or even paint brushes. To get really precise. Um, to make sure that we are not damaging the fossil. Um, so you could see how long it would take yeah. you to extract that. Now when you go to, uh, when we reopen, you come to Kosar, you go to another museum and see the big skeletons. Imagine how long it took uh, to extract that. That process. And you have kits where actual fossils are in the kits. Yes, every dinosaur kit has a real fossil inside. Wow. Um, and also some activities where you can make a fossil. Oh, cool. Uh, but now we know that, you know, you might not have uh, fossiliferous shale laying around at yeah. home. But you could do a really cool version of this activity at home. And like I said, this is on our Connects website where you could do cookie excavation. <laughs> so now it. just like there's different kinds of rocks, we've got three different kinds of cookies. Ooh, and we wanted to see if you, we, yeah, we want to see if you can get the chocolate chips out. What's that one though? That one's not chocolate chip. M&M's, Yeah, that's that would right. be like if there was different kinds of fossils. Yeah. So it's a cool challenge to try to gently get the uh, the candy out or the chocolate chips out, and then you can see how many pieces of candy or chocolate chip you can get out. And then the best part about this activity, as long as you use a clean toothpick or a clean skewer, you can eat. You can eat it. Your cookie at the end. Or if you're impatient like my child, you just rip the M and M straight out of the cookie. Yeah. So just for clarity, don't. Eat the fossils. <laughs> yes, eat the cookie. Eat the cookie. Hey, is this fun, bud? Yeah. So this is a cool ex. Uh I love, thank you. Cool experiment you can do at home <laughs> with your kids, discover what's inside your cookie. Yep. And this is on the Connects website. Yes. So yeah, while you're looking for something to do, while Coast is closed, you can go on to Connects. We have a bunch of different activities and cool videos too. And then we'll be really excited to welcome everybody back into the building when we reopen on October 4th. Yeah, very exciting stuff. but. Still a lot of learning to be done even when COSI is closed. And as we mentioned, uh, as you heard there, yeah, always fun to get out to COSI. Unfortunately, they won't be back open until October 4th, so I have to find some other ways to, to entertain yourself on a day like today. But